Hey everybody and welcome back to iHeart Board Games here live on Twitch. Tonight it's the finale, chapter 7 of Aeons in Legacy, The Last Stand. <laughs> I was like, I feel like I want to say The Last Stand for some reason. <laughs> Aeons in Legacy is designed by Kevin Riley and Nick Little and it is uh, published by Indie Boards and Cards and Action Phase Games. I am Ronald and with me I have... Two. Yes, and our other hosts are here too. Uh, and Jesse. Thank you, Slivers, for being here for just a hot minute. Yeah. We'll see you. Yeah, don't look. We'll see you next time. Um, Hugs and hearts to you, too. And thanks, Evolver26, if you're still here. Thanks for that follow yeah, when we were uh, yes. still on our entry screen. And thanks, Jesse J, for the host. Mm -hmm. We really appreciate you guys. So we have been playing um, Aeons and Legacy now, it seems, for, what, 50 weeks? Um, uh, <laughs> just kidding. We've been playing on Mondays. Seven uh, weeks? Yes, this is the seventh, seventh week, week yep. um, because we haven't had to repeat any of the chapters. But that could all change tonight. Mm. Last week, we we escaped by the skin of our hairy teeth. Teeth. Wait, how does that? Mm. I, I think that's right. Go. Something chinny, like that. Chinny teeth. Teeth. There's a chinny, chinny chin chin tooth. Chin. Yeah. Uh, we escaped by the hair of our tooth. Um, <laughs> Teeth. So, uh, <laughs> we just teeth. barely, barely made it last time, and uh, so hopefully today we'll do a little better. Maybe we should, I don't know, have strategy or something. <laughs> hey, why? Why do I only really start one time with we make a life. strategy. Is that like a new thing? I'm not good at counting, Melissa. <laughs> We're going to lose if we make a strategy. I have less life. I, there we go. Okay, now I'm good. We've, one, two, three. I thought we've had, we sort of had a strategy though. We kind of work it out. Sure. I mean, I've been doing my thing the whole time. Yeah, you're. He's just to, like, I have a strategy. Do I don't care what the rest yeah. of you do. Damage right. and try to get cards. To yeah. Us. Yep. Um, Melissa mainly does yep. damage. Charge, and then, charge, charge. And you do damage and heal, and I do mostly heal. I think so. I've done a heal like once or twice yeah. since we've started playing. <laughs> there were critical moments. I'm supposed the, to heal, but I was the healer, always dying. <laughs> yeah, I've died a bunch. You sacrificed yourself for us. That's I'm what it is. I'm too squishy. You healed all us right. and sacrificed. Speaking of which, we got new abilities. So <gasps> off camera, we all were awarded with a sticker for our card to um, give us a new power. Mine, I'll go first, was a boot, a special boot. A boot. And I call it foot in your mouth. <laughs> because once per turn during my main phase, I can discard a card. And if I do, it silences a minion. So I put my foot in their mouth. Oh. Oh. Joe, what's yours? I got some goggles. And I call them breach goggles, and this is once per turn when you focus or open a breach, deal two damage. Nice. Mm. All right, mine was a little lantern right here that I call plus one spark hype. I like it. Because it, it sparks, uh, sparks you cast deal one additional damage. So plus one is spark. Is there a way for me to give you my spark sparks? Because I don't mm. want them. <laughs> <laughs> and how about you for gumbo? I got that gree gree. It's a championship belt. Oh. Uh, when, when I destroy a card, gain a card, and I'm all about those destroying cards. So, so you gain a card from the middle, or you get to draw a card. When I destroy a card, gain a charge. Oh, a charge. Okay, I think I'm sorry. I did say card. Charge. But yeah, I meant charge. Well, we are all about charges, and you're all about destruction. So that that was like literally made for you. Oh yeah, yeah. You had, to, yeah. had to win it in hell in the cell. I did. <laughs> there My was a summer slam. Just went out. summer slam hell in the cell. <laughs> All right, we were here quite late last time, so we're gonna get started. <laughs> Makes sense. Ooh, that's spicy. Is that Gumbo's music? Uh oh, oh, oh no. ah. He's here we're, with we're a chair. Away. I'm running away with it. <laughs> <laughs> All right, back on track. All right, all right. All right. Drop these. No. Wait. Oh yeah, I got a spark. Here, Jesse. Charge there. You're the most dramatic, so read that. All right. So it says it's chapter seven. Chapter seven, introduction. <laughs> Maelstrom has come, and you stand before it, readying for the fight. The creature is so massive, and its minions so numerous, that you are separated from the other mages. The sky above New Gravehold, a.k.a. New Gloomhaven, <laughs> is darkened with Maelstrom's presence. It's, oh, its beacons dot the ground below it trying to open more breaches to summon even more minions. They cannot be allowed to succeed. You feel a sense of calm as the battle approaches. 
You can defeat Maelstrom. You can close this breach. New Gravehold must survive. Like, what about regular Gravehold, the old one that we just let fall? <laughs> it's gone. Yeah. No, 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 forget about it. Forget about it. Okay. <laughs> you feel a part of something bigger, as if every moment in your life was leading up to this one. The battle begins in slow motion as Maelstrom begins spinning, its large blade slicing toward the ground. Within moments, more breaches open, and swarms of minions claw their way out. The future lies in your hands. The final battle has begun. Read the front of L44. It's the final battle! Open playmat labeled Chapter 7. Yes. Happy I ate $93 worth of snacks, and now I have a stomach oh. ache day, everyone. Oh, that's... Oh. <laughs> 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 How did you know? <laughs> Actually, I'm going to need to leave the stream. No, uh, <laughs> yeah, um, that was bad. Did Tony win? <laughs> mm. Tony, Tony, Tony. My preferred game show did not win, but oh. a show, I knew what show was going to win, so what can you say? What can you do? You knew it? I knew. Wow, you should have put a bet down. Yeah. Um, I had printed out um, ballots for everyone to fill out, uh -huh. and I, of course, got the most right of anyone. It, but not that it's a chat. Not that it's like a game or anything. <laughs> not that I'm competitive. <laughs> but I got the most right. And um, I did eat a lot of snacks. And I told my friend, don't bring any food. I bought so much food. If you come in this house with food, I'll be very mad. How come he walks in with four grocery bags full of food, including a full cake for two people? <laughs> I'm like, I already went overboard once for the both of us. Okay. We're not here, We're not here for this. Yeah. Thank you, Greybeard. <laughs> yes. Open that. No, wait, I still didn't have it right. open. I have been instructed. I know cake was involved. Yes. <laughs> cake? We would have yeah. been there. Cake, cake was involved. All right. I've been instructed to open this final chapter. All right. <laughs> All right. Open it up. Anytime now. Come on. Whenever you can. <laughs> Go for it. Okay. Oh. That was that thing from the beginning. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You didn't know. He's risen. He is risen. Well, we didn't defeat him the first time. Oh. Right. He just like left or whatever. He just destroyed everything and left. So he's um he's looking. Here's his that little, much more evil. Here's his little. Cousin. I'm gonna put that in the box oh, yeah. over there. Wow. And that's it. Right. Nothing else. So, it also says open seven deck, combine all the Maelstrom Risen Nemesis cards with the basic cards you used last game to form the Nemesis deck, which I already did. It's over there. Following the instructions on page 10 of the rule book. Fight Maelstrom Risen. Read the back of this card after your first game versus Maelstrom. So, not much there. All right. To set up, shuffle the beacon cards together. That's these. All right. Could you shuffle those? Beacon They're cards. like not shuffled at all, so. And place them face down to form the beacon deck. Draw two cards from the beacon deck and place them into play. Do not resolve any immediately effects on those cards. Replace one of the Nemesis turn order cards in the turn order deck with Maelstrom's assault turn card. So we have a special card this game which says assault turn. And what the game has instructed me to do is take out one of the Nemesis cards and replace it with this Assault turn. Mm. So he's going to have a regular turn, and then he's going to have not a regular turn. <laughs> Yay. Uh, Melissa, could you shuffle that up for me? <laughs> Why me? All right, here's what it says. We should have known better than to consider Maelstrom defeated. In our hubris, we left our old lives behind and considered Maelstrom buried along with them. Yet, it was siphoning power the entire time we've been on the surface, slowly gathering strength to take revenge. And now, the time for its revenge has come. It looms over New Gravehold, and I fear there is little we can do to stop it. In our first battle against Maelstrom, we only managed to survive through Desmodius' sacrifice. This time around, we cannot afford to lose another. Our newest breach mages need to be stronger than any before. They must triumph. Why aren't the teachers helping us? The teachers know. are always like, like we're not available tiger. right now. <laughs> All right, Harry Potter, you guys go over there and fight the dark 
the Dark Lord. Yeah. We're gonna go over here and teach. <laughs> oh, good. He has sixty-five hit points. It's coffee break time. Hey, that's not a lot compared to the others. This is this is my teacher planning hour. Yes, this is teacher. I'm you having don't get, my only coffee. get one of these. You know, I can't the be day. bothered. Could it's someone who zero. understands numbers Could tell me if this is the correct value hours. for this? This is the correct value. Thirty. So when he unleashes, we'll draw a card from the beacon deck and place it into play. Great. Mm -hmm. When Maelstrom's Assault turn card, turn order card is drawn, Gravehold suffers one damage for each beacon in play. Then Maelstrom takes a turn as normal. The Assault turn order card is considered a Nemesis turn order card. Okay. When a beacon is discarded, place it in the beacon discard pile next to the beacon deck. This is not the same as the Nemesis discard pile. When the beacon deck is empty and a card would be drawn from it, shuffle the beacon discard pile and place it face down to form a new beacon deck. Yay! Of course. We're never, we're never it's rid never of ending. When there are 10 beacons in play, Maelstrom Risen opens a massive destructive breach and the players lose. Yay. I think we got this. Got it. I'm gonna get him. So we are gonna have two beacons in play to begin. A misery beacon. Lovely. And... A training beacon. How fun. Oh, how lovely. Wouldn't it be lovely? Oh, cool. I can get rid of one of those on, on my first turn. I can get one, too. Because I have plus one to my sparks now. I can't. Spark. Oh. <laughs> I can discard a card to make one shut up. <laughs> be quiet, you. Why does it say immediately? Uh, it said to ignore those for the first oh. ones that we put out. Here, this can be here, and we have two discard piles. Mm. So when we, um, so these are just here right now. They don't have any ability, but this gives us an idea of what kinds of effects they have. Okay. Um, yeah, there seem to be repeats. Whenever I was just like looking at it to shuffle it a little bit. All right, let's get started. Let's get started. Anybody watch that YouTuber? No. Ah, that's us. Sound. All right. Uh, turn order. Great. We should let him go ahead. Yeah. <laughs> just let him go. So yeah, nothing, nothing. Because they don't have persistent abilities. So. Feminist coil. Venomous coil. Venomous. Yes. So to discard that, we need six ether. Um, if we don't, it's going to unleash twice, then any player will suffer damage equal to the number of beacons in play. Mm. Beacons? Beacons. Yeah, those, these things. Oh, those are beacons. <laughs> yes. Did I say? Is this yeah, beacon. It says it here. It says it there, but it says Bacon. Bacon. Yeah. Mm, I smell oh, bacon. it says misery beacon, draining beacon. Yeah, <laughs> draining bacon. 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 Mm, that's bacon. There you go. Right. Well, I think one of you guys should go. Yeah, that sounds like a good plan. Right. I can get rid of one spark. And I can reveal the top card to see if it's one of those things to put at the bottom. You do. Okay. All right. So could I'm you going... do 65 damage to him, please? I could get rid of a beacon. Okay. <laughs> well, I'm doing Useless. 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 I'm doing something. Here. Come on. All right. So I prep this spark. Spell hype to my spark hype. So that's two damage with the spark to um, the, the draining beacon, the one that takes damage, that suffers the damage. So it does two damage, right? Because you have spark hype. Yeah, spark hype. So it deals uh, plus one spark hype. Okay, so this is done. And then I get to uh, gain. So that's one, two, three, four. I have four here. Um, hmm. There used to be a spot that showed like... Yeah, that's what I'm wondering. Because <laughs> usually on Eons and Legacy it's like zero. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know who the people that voted for this game are, but they... They left. <laughs> they have been waiting until they play it. I guess. Yeah. Sure. They, were like, they were curious about it, and then they saw how it played, and they were like, eh, nothing. Eh. <laughs> yeah, well. I'm going to grab up uh, something. I have four ether. 
I'm gonna grab one of these. Okay. Right here, right. and then I'll reveal the top card. That that can stay. And I'm done. All right, Jesse, you want to go or should I? I'll. Go. I'm just gonna prep spells. Is all I'm gonna do. Yeah, I think that's mostly what I'm doing, but so I really don't. I'll go. Ooh, that's spicy. Take up most music. Four crystals. <laughs> yeah. Ooh, oh, God, that's spicy. That's good, most music. <laughs> so bad, exactly. Crystals, really. <laughs> and then that's my turn. Was it? Was the song you like? Pick, put down. Fiddle. Oh look! Oh. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Louisiana Saturday oh, coffee no, shoes, no, and you no, throw no, them on the no. floor. Dance in the no, kitchen no, to the no, morning no, light. No, Louisiana no, Saturday no, night. No, no, no. <laughs> All right, I don't remember what it's supposed to do. Whenever we get this, oh yes, we suffer one damage to grave hole, please. Uh oh. So oh, damage. for each beacon in play. So one. Yep. So then he takes a regular turn. One, two, so nine. Nothing happens here. Um, this one just loses a token, and Creeping Curse. Love those. To discard, just evolve. Oh. I bet it'll come out. <laughs> it's going to go in the discard pile, yeah. usually. They usually go right into the discard pile whenever we've evolved to them in the past. I mean, we might as well... Make us have to deal with it next time, if there's a next time. If there's a next time. If we lose. If we lose. The next time. Well, let's just worry about it in a minute. What's, oh. That's next time's it's, problem. Way to it's, uh, it unleashes, then any player suffers two damage, and then the players collectively discard two cards in hand. Hmm. Sure, it doesn't seem bad now, but we've said that in the past, and look what it's gotten us. We've won every game. Not, Not every no game. Jinxing us. Oh, right, except for that one. That that everyone bad. loses. <laughs> I didn't right. look that up. Orlando. Orlando. Great, so I'm going to. There's a. Oh, yeah, I can do that. This. I'm going to focus a breach. And so I can do. Deal two damage. So should I do it to the beacon or to him? To the beacon! What? Should he hit the beacon with two, or should he just do it to the to Maelstrom? I actually think you should do it to Maelstrom. Yeah, I danger. mean, we already saw the Nemesis card come out, right? Yeah. The the one that is based on beacons or whatever. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, because, I guess you um, could always hit it next time. It's true. Yeah, okay. he, he doesn't have a persistent effect. He's just there. Yeah. Yeah. So he's something that would get counted. So let's do that. All right. See, I got rid of one because it's gonna, if a nemesis thing came out and I knew someone's gonna come out, it counts the beacon, so to have one less. Right, it does do more stuff. damage to Gravehold than more of those that are yeah. out. But So I got rid of one plus damage to Gravehold. And then I'll use Joe's keeping Gravehold uh, three by the I believe in him. Torporine. There you go. Done? Yes. It's right. me. It's you. Could you shuffle this? Pass me that token. You don't have to pass it to me. All right, I'm gonna do just what I said I was gonna do. Here's three crystals to open this breach. Ooh, opening breaches. Mm -hmm. And then I'm gonna prep these spells into these two breaches that I have opened. Which is the same I've had for my first turn for a while now. And that's it for me. Nice. Oh, I wonder what my other five... Oh, I'm so shocked at these five cards. Yeah, every time. I'm always so surprised. Like, really? These cards? Really? I'm really? Gonna start, I'm going to start putting this on here. So whenever I cast it, I remember to take that. Because I feel like I forget that. I don't forget any of mine, I don't think. That will work pretty well. Rose or Orlando. Rose or Orlando. I can take out the beacon now. We're gonna do two damage again. I can I can take out the beacon with this minion's bane because okay. it does extra damage to minions. Okay. So if you want to take hit him, go for it. Is that considered a? Oh, it is considered a minion. I yep. see. Yep. Mm -hmm. 
Yeah, all, I'm, all I'm doing is prepping spell so you can go ahead and hit him. There you go. The faster we take him out, the once, better. Yeah, because once, that's, <laughs> my, that's my opinion. Yeah, because yeah, he needs Last time was bad. Okay. Last time was okay. really bad. Oh, I'm like way too close to you, huh, Joe? I can make up. I can move back. I'm gonna... I kind of move forward because I'm trying to get out of your way. You're right. Yeah, you have a little space to move back if you. You can do it whenever, whenever it's someone else's turn. No. Right, so I do two. two I can't it out. <laughs> Okay. Did that work? A little view counts down. And. Oh. It was never right, anyways. True, but. But it um, gave us an idea. I'm just gonna look at. Who's on these two? I have it here. Yeah, it's fine. I don't care. Oh, Joe, remember your uh, discard pile has to be all face up. I was wondering why it's right. different, you know? That means something's wrong. Mm -hmm. Typically. Yay! So that's the two I use now. That's yeah. working. This is two I'm keeping. Yeah, yeah, chat's working. All right, so you're done? Yes. The Nemesis! <gasps> Nothing. This gets removed. This gets removed. Oh, look. Eternal Glare. To discard, spend seven ether. Nope. If not, reveal the top card of the turn order deck. If it's a player turn order card, unleash three times. Otherwise, any player suffers five we damage. We haven't played we haven't a full played game, the, the game of full it game. We only did a demo. Travis is the only one who's played the full game. Yep. He will not want to play that with you. <laughs> I can tell you that. I'll play it since I never played the full game of it. Since I only did the demo, just because to play the. To play I think the they game. probably will have it in the um, in the Witch McCall in the library. Yeah, yeah. All right, let's see. Here we got Gumbo or <laughs> Meredith. I will go unless you have something important you want to do because I can take out that beacon with my minions bang. Go for it. Makes no difference to me. So I will use Minion's Bane. I'm not going to forget my charge this time. Charge! Two damage to this Misery Beacon, so it'll get out of here. Um, Would you like to spin six I'm also going to cast this spark seven ether. <laughs> to get him down to 60. Ooh. And then I'm going to prep two more spells. I... I think we should do this. <laughs> Hi. Hello. Hello. <laughs> oh, computers. If it ain't one thing, it's something else, you guys. Yep. All right. I was like, oh, someone's still in our chat. Oh, it's Melissa. It's me. Uh, <laughs> okay, so we were just talking about evolving this card right here. So we're going to put read card E48, please, Jesse. E48. We're evolving that. The creeping curse. Watch, it's like you lose. Mm, much. No. Uh, you feel the curse take shape, bubbling under your skin like a plague. It is your burden to end this curse before it can spread, and you must study it without fully succumbing to its madness. Banish Creeping Curse. Write the name of the player who evolved Creeping Curse on E49. Another card with my name on it. That's right. Wait a second, why am I not seeing this? There you go. Graybeard's in our chat, talking to us yeah. about Dice Tarkon. Yay! Yeah. Stealing snacks, yeah. Flirting with the girlfriend. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So, what, what did it say? Put this to the discard? Discard. <laughs> Yes. Put, no, it didn't. It Watch said put this out of the game, didn't it? Yeah. Not to discard it. Banish it, it said. Banish it. Get yourself in trouble. Stealing all those snacks. Snitch. Mm -mm. I know a guy I that like buys like $90 stores. worth of snacks at a time. Mm. I'm going to spend these three crystals to purchase Why am I not seeing this slides? sparking Sorry. siphon we just went on. What's on? I know, it's just I'm not seeing it. Oh, it just popped up. Okay, cool. All right, so that's it for me. So we'll go on to Rose. Rose. Me. Rose. I'm it's not on your phone. It's Rosa. Here. I know. I was Don't worry about it. It's on. We're live. It's on. It's fine. I saw it. As long as it's recording, it's all good. Yeah. Hey, Hello, Jenna. 
All right, for me, I'm going to prep these here two spells and then cast them. I, I see can't. Katie tipped last night. Yay! Oh, yeah, yeah. She raided in and uh, left us a little tip there. Katie, quick sonic. Oh, what? Yeah, we had a raid. We had a raid yesterday like while I was gone? People. Yeah. What? Yeah. You missed all the excitement. Yeah, and she tipped and we hung out, had a good old time. Mm. How nice. How um. sweet. <laughs> I was, I'm sorry I missed it. <laughs> all right, I'm going to. I was open eating $93 breach. worth of um, <laughs> snacks. I'm going to open this breach with my three crystals. Mm -hmm. For the future. For the future. Mm -hmm. Right, done. <gasps> Zero damage to Maelstrom. Good. Yes. All right, this is gonna pop. Mm -hmm. So deal to deacons, uh, two deacons. Deacons. Deacon. <laughs> oh. Protective beacon, just, just... protective beacon. I will take care of one of those beacons. I will too. Oh. Hello, Jesse! Hey, hey, how's it going? How have you then, been? Then, any player suffers damage equal to the number of beacons in play. Oops. So someone needs to suffer two damage. I can do it. Alright. National Egg Roll Day. One. Yum, yum. Oh, I want egg rolls now. <laughs> Doesn't take much to convince her. <laughs> don't do anything, and then a new card comes out. Oh, good. Oh, no. This is Meredith. Great. That's mm -hmm. you. Yep. Oh, Unleash. No. Get a new minion coming out here. <laughs> the Guardian Beacon. Mm -hmm. <gasps> oh, What's happening? <laughs> Meredith suffers four damage. Lovely. Wow. Gonna yep. be dead I'm at soon. four hit points and gains two charges. Hey, I'm halfway there. There you go. Yay! Getting some life back. <laughs> <laughs> that was awfully like a lot and fast. Like, we're like, hey, can somebody check that? Meredith's like, oh, I'll jump on it. <laughs> <laughs> and gumbo. And gumbo. I will deal. Let's see. Deal one damage if you discard. Pile contains four more of the cards, so two additional damage. So I'll take out one of the protective beacons, I think. And then it says, and reveal the top card of your deck. I don't have a deck. So I get one. Yep. I mean, it says I may destroy it. I'm not going to do that because I just bought that. I need to remember to not do that. Of course, it's the last game. Who cares? All right. You keep yeah, but it's like the first. One well, of the first if, it, if we do it again, I'll remember to not buy something uh. on the first turn. <laughs> I'll try to remember. Try to remember. Let's go with. So I have four crystals again. I need to try to destroy stuff to get charges and therefore help everyone. So I'm gonna buy one of these again. And the four crystals go here. And my turn is over. Two damage to Grave Hole, please. One of these goes off. Nothing, nothing. Mm-hmm. Oh, oh look. Dear. Unleash twice. And then Orlando discards their most expensive prepped spell. Oh no, the spark is gone. Ah. You lost that spark. <laughs> oh my <laughs> Uh, any player even. discards a card in hand. Oh, I don't even have hand yet. Wait a second. Any player. I can get rid of a crystal. I can get rid of a crystal as well. Do you really want to keep your crystal, or you really can just... Um, I, I mean, I have mine. six power, so I mean, I'm not really buying That's it. six either? Yeah. Well, that can get you the big guy. That, but that is... That just... Get your pulse tokens and can potentially be what three, a value of three. Plus, if I'm giving you extra pulse tokens, you could have a whole bunch of stuff. Okay. You can turn I'll pulse tokens into it. ether, is what it does. Yeah, I'm getting rid of the crystal. Yeah, but I, yeah, it's okay. I'll do it. Yeah, because we uh, talked about that before. But I can turn into quite a bit of ether. Hmm. Okay. 
So uh, that's, that's it for this. The unforeseen collapse happened, and now we're going to move on. Mm -hmm. Orlando or Rose? All right, I better take care of some, some stuffy stuffs. All right. I suppose. All right, so these are two apiece. Mm -hmm. So I could get rid of that guy for sure. Yeah. Because it's just two. That's one spark. And then this could either take care of two from this, or I could take care of one of these shields. I'll just take two off of that. All right. And then I'm going to prep this spark and do my spell height to then kill that thing. Because I need to do oh, the you spark. You could have taken out a guardian beacon. Should I take another guardian beacon instead? I mean, they d it's all the same. Not really. Well, I mean, guardian he does three points. Oh, okay, yeah. yeah. So take out the guardian one points, then. So. so I would have taken out a shield, but that's one spark. Okay. And then here's two, two for, the for the other. That makes sense. Okay. So then I have this. Uh, reveal that top card. All right, that's good. And Next, then, get ready. <laughs> right, and so that's uh, gain one. So one. Two, three, four, five. I have five. Because this is not. You could get an arcane right? salvo. I can't. These are these are oh. my spells. But I can't open this. So then in the future, then this can do an additional ether. Okay. I can open this breach. Because I can't get spells with these. Mm hmm. Right. Yeah. I'm just. I'm gonna open this breach. Nice. Now you have space for spells. You just don't have any of the spells yet. Yeah. But you're set yourself up. All done? All done. I wonder who's next. Oh, wow. Orlando. Yeah. Look at that. All right, so I'm going to do the six and pick up the... Very seven. nice. Um, isn't... Oh, okay, that's not a spell. One, two, yeah. I forgot that it only says you can't buy spells. Oh, yeah, yeah, we couldn't buy anything. You can't buy anything. <laughs> It's broken it's, crystal. It's That's what broken. I thought it was. If you're done? Yes. The nemesis. Ah, uh, good. Reveal the top card of the main turn order deck. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I already knew what it was going to say. Mm -hmm. If it's a player turn order card, unleash three times. Oh. Lovely. All that work. One, two, three. What work? So, any player suffers one damage. Uh, uh, not it. I'll do it. <laughs> not it, not I. The player with the lowest life suffers one damage. That's me. Lovely. Oh, wow. Which the player with the lowest life suffers one damage. That's me again. Oi. Oh, dear. All right. And, uh, so that goes out. Oh, remember him? Oh, mm -hmm. no. The Spine Reaper. Mmm, <sighs> looks like a delicious lunch. Mm. He has four shields now. That's no egg rolls. No, indeed. No, indeed. This is... That is crunchy, though, when you bite into him. Like an egg, like an egg roll should be. Yeah, on with bones in it. What's going to happen oh, on, no. on its turn <laughs> is... Gravehold's gonna suffer. Grave, um, we're gonna get another one of these to come out, mm -hmm. and someone's gonna suffer two damage every time it has a turn. Cool. So bad. <laughs> so bad. Uh, Gumbo or Meredith? Do something quick! <laughs> Please! You. All right. We'll take care of the two one thing, the grave beacons, because that's just one. You got two sparks. It's true. Is that what you guys less. would like to happen with that? I think you would like that. Yeah, it's two less. That's yeah. the it's suffer. A, it doesn't, it's not a persistent effect. I know, but oh, it's, it's immediate. two less. And, and let me also say this. As long as those are sitting on the table, we're not drawing them, and the immediate effect cannot take place. But it's also Fair. hurting this. Yeah. Yes, but if we just kill these and leave these ones there. Okay. It's true. You can because kill is every time we shuffle this deck and they come back out, it hits me again. Well, then we take care of the shields. 
when we get ready to draw <coughs> one, we'll show. Yeah. yeah, that's what I'm saying. Wow. Like Take care of the shields then. Hey, so JG Law. JG Law, hello. Hey, How day. Take care of the shields, because we can't even do anything if those shields are there, even if we have damage. These ones? Yeah, I think those. Really? Really? Joe, what what's your vote? Assistant? Effective this what? one, yeah. this one always brings out a new minion and suffers some person suffers he two damage. He needs to go. Wow. Yeah. He's he really bad. Yeah. Because we kept evolving him over and over again. Oh, right. And he's guy. only got two hit points if those shields are gone. True. I'm going to prep some more spells. Good. And then I've got this, which I'm going to go ahead and buy another Sparking Siphon, because this is going to be my spell of du jour. I'm going <laughs> to just keep doing this, because this thing lets me heal. Right. Oh, um, nice. So nice. I'm going to keep putting my money into that card. Fair. Oh, I can't buy that. Oh, no. It's a spell. You, got the, yeah. okay. you can get this thing instead and just silence Get a nice so gem. You can silence me. Or you can get this relic to gain charges, which helps you. Yeah, I could. I'll do that. I'm going to trash one card because I'm going to put my foot in your mouth. <gasps> oh, I forgot what that And was. I'm going to shut this dude up. Oh, nice. Go sleep. And then these two I'm going to spend to get another charge. That's what I'm going to do. Good. Cool. Because that does help us gain life. Has anybody down three hit points yet? Mm -mm. All right, well, the next time somebody needs to get hurt. <laughs> <laughs> Gumbo. It's me. One damage to the guy we don't like. All right. I'm gonna if if I come up first, first, he'll be dead. I just want to say that. Um, then I can lose to the minion a pulse token to destroy a card on my hand, which I will. Whenever I get destroyed, gain a charge. You said that. Charge! <laughs> <laughs> and uh, so I have three relics worth of that here. I'll take a brain knife and call it a day. Rose or Orlando? Um, I'm just prepping a spell. So if you have a way to hurt something, you, you might do. need to go first. Um. Zero damage. I'm just prepping a scale. And How's it going, JG Lodge? Have a good weekend. I gotta do this. And I'm focusing on this one. Play any game. So I do two. Hmm. It's back, Jesse. <gasps> He's back. It's back. That thing you Counter. were looking for earlier. <laughs> you can't control these things. I do two damage. Which one should I do? I really think I need to, to wipe this thing. <laughs> I'm gonna be able to kill him on my turn. Yeah, I would take care of and the he's, shield. And he's silenced. So if you're doing two damage, I would take this out. Oh, I'll do that. oh okay. I didn't even see that little guy. He saw you though. <gasps> mm -hmm. And then I'll buy another Toblerone. 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 We should have had those for today. It's oh, our finale. So when I spent my $93, I should have gotten some Toblerone. Toblerone. Instead I got two giant bags of M&Ms. Wow. What kinds? Regular and peanut. Are there other kinds? Caramel. Caramel. Good one. Oh. Get out. You're not and American. Peanut butter is good too. <laughs> I, I'm just kidding. I, I I don't hate on any of the M&Ms except for the mint. The <laughs> mint weren't that bad. Well, the I don't like talking with my mint. Mm. Actually, I didn't see the caramel ones when I was at the store. I saw yeah. the pretzel ones, the crispy Ooh, ones. Nice pretzels. Good. All right, we're done. It tastes like little Rolos, yes. I think. Mm -hmm. The Nemesis. Ah. Nothing. 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 Think. And but does something happen to this? No. Only, Only on the other assaulted. one. Oh. oh look, it's a minion. Whipping wires. If Whipping this, wires? If this is the assault turn, any player suffers two damage. Otherwise, unleash. Mm. Wow. So not good. Sure. Well, we're, we, at least we're down five hit points up here. That's something. Help progress. I can get rid of Spine Reaper if you want me to go. All right, so I'm going to spark this off of here. And then Minion's Bane does two damage because it's a minion, so that will kill this. So that goes in a different pile, right? yeah. Yeah. I had him, like, I don't know what I was doing. Hmm. Uh, so this goes over here. 
This goes in here. Oh, I can make it myself. I can make it myself. Someone else doesn't have to get hurt. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Any player, that's you. Oh, when you gain this, gain two pulse tokens. I didn't do that when I gained it. I should have. Oh, when you gain this. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm. It's not as good as I thought it was. Well, I can keep feeding you pulse tokens, eventually. I'm gonna spend these three crystals to buy another one. <laughs> gain two pulse tokens. Yep. Yeah! How many have you gotten over time? Take That's second? The, yeah, this is only the second one, because a lot of my crystals are damaged. Right, right. So. Damage. Um, that's it for me. Assault. How much damage are, uh, is Gravehold taking, Melissa? It's like, why are you asking her? Just curious if she's been following okay. at all. Okay. <laughs> mm, don't want to do it. How much? Five. No. 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 None. No. <laughs> one, so two, three, between. four. Beacons. Between Only the beacons, not this one. So four. Four. <laughs> mm-hmm. One, two, three, four. Oh, yeah. oh, oh. <laughs> and if this is the assault turn, any player suffers two damage. I'll do it. Great. Because I'm bleeding out. Right, right. All right. Oh, slice. We're getting sliced. What's that? The, in three turns, the power, the player with the most expensive card in hand degrades that card and suffers three damage. Nice. So once Discard again, it and draw the other thing. You have to destroy it. You have to destroy it, yeah. Yeah. And then you may gain a card of the same type from any supply pile which costs less than the cost of the destroyed card and place it in their hand. If you can't, you suffer two damage. Lovely. What's going on back there? <laughs> All of mine are zeros right now, so that's at least a good thing. Yeah. Joe, did you draw that purple card yet? Yes. I have it now. Okay. Hopefully I'll go before you. Have Gumbo! You wait, you've already gone this turn. No, wait, you'll go next yeah, turn. Yeah, he's gone already. Do you need pulse tokens to make things happen in your turn? Um, let's see. No, I, that's not right, Melissa. I just put that there. Oh, 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 you already went. I don't have seven. So should we make it a crazy amount? I mean, what, what would I do? I don't know. <laughs> I was just asking. <laughs> Mega buy it. All right, so maybe not then. But in I case mean, you need it for later. I was going to buy another one. So. Yeah, I mean, you have enough for that already. It don't hurt. Sometimes these things say discard know, seven or eight ether or something to get rid of things. So. And when that happens, I'll be ready for it. Um, That's what I'm saying. I was going to get another one of these. That way I'd I have one hand to be stacked. I mean, because I could keep destroying my cards and keep getting some charges. So Which one that's destroys? What gonna do. I gotta go take care of this so one. Destroy one. Destroy a crystal, which gives me a charge. And so I have three to buy, which will get more charge making stuff. And soon I'll be charge making machine I once was. Two, three, four, five. Next turn. It's um Rose. Proof. Me, me. Did right. you? Tissue play. Nose was. This sticker. Okay. <clears throat> I prep this spark. And then I have four. There's. So I'm going to get two chargers. All right. Oy, oy, oy. That cat is so ridiculous. She's got her paw hanging off the edge. You can't quite see it on camera. Yeah. It's like me. Back there, though. <laughs> there you go. Oh, yeah, I see it there. <laughs> you can just see the paw hanging off. <laughs> right down here. Oh. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Watch it, bump! <laughs> oh, the nemesis. Oh, no. Nothing, 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 nothing. Unleash. Yeah. So I need to shuffle these up. Three, second, two. No, no, no one's like, it's going to be unleashed. And it's an unleash instead. Ugh. Any player discards a card in hand. Misery beacon. Oh, wait, I don't have any cards in hand. Wait. I have, a, I have my spark. 
I get rid of, or do we need it? I'll discard a card. Okay. Or I can get rid of it, because I have... No, I'll discard a card, four, that's fine. Five. And then we have, oh, this old friend. The Ravenous Leviathan. Oh yeah. He'd be nothing without us. Yeah, we're actually running short of these uh, hit point marker things because we have so many bad guys on the field. Whoops. So that's bad. <laughs> All right. His persistent ability is that Gravehold suffers two damage and then he evolves. Right. Lando or Rose? I will go, I suppose. Unless you have something in particular to do. Mm -hmm. Alright, I will go. First, this spark for two damage. Um, Kill this one. I was wondering if I should just outright kill one or try to take down some stuff off the other one. Yeah, just go ahead and kill that one. I don't know what your whole entire plan looks like, so you tell us what's best. I mean, the most I'm going to be able to do is two more damage. Oh, kill something. That's fine. Yeah, get to the point where one. getting stuff off of the board okay. is really a good idea. Yeah. So, all right. So, Bravehold uh, is going to take a lot. Yeah. All right. So that spark to that guy for two damage. Mm -hmm. Now I have these two sparks and a spell hype. Mm -hmm. So I can send another one out for two more damage. You want to hurt? I mean, I can outright kill one of the great beacons, but that's wasting a damage. I can take the shield off of the guardian beacon, so it's easier to kill. I think you should take two off of this one. I can, if my turn's up, I can kill him in one shot. Oh, this thing? Mm -hmm. I think that shield needs to come off. It makes it easier to kill. Well, somebody I got a one. That. I got a one spark oh, right here. Spark, yeah. um, Why don't you just take two? Yeah, take two off of one of these like baddies. Yeah. Um, and yeah, that guy that unleashes this one. Yeah, it's fine. So two there. And I have a look at the top card of the turn order. All right. Be ready. You're gonna be next. <laughs> Every time she looks at it, it's your yeah. card. Nope. There's some kind of trickery going on here. Like a lack of shuffling, maybe. Ooh, you mess up with fire over there. Ooh, look at them claws. <laughs> All right, so that's one, two, three, She's like, and don't make me look at you like that again. Five, so I have five, yeah. but I can't, I can't buy a spell. Is the you could buy a level four spell, right? Yeah, because I have this one, one. Yeah, so you could get two, this three, four. force transfusion yeah. or that breach communion. Mm. Yeah, this one. Because the other one does five damage if you feed it a thing. Uh huh. Should I go for that? I don't that know if you this? read it or not, but. This gives me charges, yeah, though, if I have three more charges. I like that too. I'll get this. Great. What does that do? It gives me, if it deals three damage, and if I have three more charges, I can gain a charge. You get a free charge out of it. All right. I wonder right. who's next. So that was for four, so the other, this oh. this crystal just doesn't get used. You can either keep it in hand or you can discard it. Um, I'll keep it in hand. All right. So then this goes here, it's here, and this stays in hand one, two. Orlando. That's the token. So I have this. Nice. So you gain two pulse tokens. tokens. You don't have to use them now, but you can. This is two, um, three, is that 20 or less life? Nope. That's four. I need you to could make it up to things. six if you spend these. What's, what's five? I could do six and buy, should I buy another one of those or should I buy a damage spell? Yeah, damage spell would be good because you know that'd be another source of damage. Not mad at that. Um, yeah, I don't know. What does the the five one do? 
Yeah, this this ability damage. that's on the top of here is kind of weird. When prepped, once per turn during your main phase, you may place a relic you played this turn or a relic in your discard pile on top of your deck. It recycles your relics back faster. Okay, I have no relics. Correct. <laughs> but it does deal four damage. What's yeah. the other one do? How many? That does two. This, this one does, does three. three, and if you have three more charges, you gain a charge. This one does two damage, but if you lose two pulse tokens, it's five damage. Well, it's prepped, you get one. Yeah, you get one every time that it's sitting there. So basically when you put it out, you can grab one. And you can grab another one next turn if you just leave it out, but I wouldn't recommend that. Let's see, that's one, two, three, four, five. So I'll get, how many pulse tokens can you have? Unlimited? Mm-hmm. Yeah. I'll get that then. The Breach Communion? Yeah. And you get one right now for prepping it. Mm, he's not no, prepping oh, it, he just bought it. it. Oh, just, okay. Cool. Who's next? Are you done, Joe? <coughs> yes. You wanna go? Yeah. Go. Um, I got a spark here, so mm -hmm. I'll spark. Off that shield. Um, the shield off. And then here, this is Sparking Siphon. I'm going to deal two damage to this guy. Mm -hmm. Send him away. I'm going with you. And then it says, Lo you may lose a pulse token. If you do, any player gains one life. I see. I'm you going gain. to do that. You gain it. Here's the pulse token, and I will f go up to three hit points. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> Do it again! Do it again! Oh, he's now almost I'm charged prep up all the way. Two charges here, two sparks here, mm -hmm. and then, hmm. A what charge! Are these? I'm gonna go ahead and spin those. Oh, they don't go there. I'm gonna spin those to get my last charge here. And I'm gonna go ahead and, uh, yep. I'm gonna go ahead and go ahead and use life hack. Nice. When I activate that, any player gains three life. That's you. Oh, well, maybe I should wait on this then until someone else needs it. Because if I want to gain the extra two life, I have to be under four. Where are you right now? I'm at three, but if I gain the three life, I'll have six. Gotcha. Eh. But you don't want to just be knocked out all of a sudden. You have a lot of names on those cards. Yeah. All right, in I that case, I'll just gain three life. And just forget about the rest. What's the two come from? The extra. The, if I have four or less life, I gain two. Hmm. Oh, so if you let someone else heal, you would gain two life? That's right. But no one else is short three hit points, so it would be Fair. a waste. Well, I mean, I like, could send two to Joe and then like two, two to two me. Two instead of yeah. just three. That's better, I think. Yeah. All right. Four points out there instead of three. So, so I'm gonna just be at five then, because I was um, at three, and if I gain two, I'm at five. All right, and Joe Joe's at back at ten. Yeah, Joe's healing three, but he can only go up right. to his maximum. All right, well, that's something to keep in mind. I always have someone that's three down. Because <laughs> we can play. It doesn't time. take much work to no, do that usually. This guy, I think I'm just going to let him fall and All not right. use him. Falling crystal. Gumbo. It's Gumbo. Me. Gumbo in the pot. If I have four cards in the discard, which I do, I can deal three damage. Let's kill the protective beacon and reveal choo, the top choo. card of my deck. I can destroy it, and I will, which gives me a crystal. Let's prep a spark. Let's play a brain knife, which gains me a charge, and someone can focus their lowest focus cost breach. I will. All right. And um, I think I will gain three pulse tokens, but destroy one to destroy a card in hand, which gives me a charge. I have two here, so I'll gain another charge, and I'll use them all. Everyone draws two cards. Yay! 
and reveal the turn order deck. All one card of them. Gee, I wonder what it is. Oh. Oh, that's coming our way. Be aware. <laughs> and that is... That happened faster than before, I think. <laughs> I think so. Uh, that's me. So we have one, two... If this is the assault turn, any player suffers two damage. I'll oh. do it. Okay. Yeah, you just got full life. That's true. All right, this loses one. This guy, Gravehold, suffers two damage. Mm -hmm. And then evolve. 20. Now we're at 19. Okay. We need some help, y'all. That's good because Joe's ability doesn't work unless Gravehold's under five, under 20. Oh. Time to get to work. Days. Any player suffers two damage and discards a card in hand. Mm. Well, the problem is I don't want to have to discard a card because I'm going to write it exactly so getting charges. But I don't... You don't need to suffer damage. Oh, I can discard... Um, I mean, I can suffer the damage. I can discard a spark. Can somebody else... Can it be separate? I can, let me do, no. do a crystal. Cause All right, because I mean, I have four spells in my hand, and I can't, I can't prep four spells. So I'm gonna have to just keep holding this spark. You know what I'm saying? Oh, uh, it's just gonna sense. clog up my hand. Okay. So I'm gonna discard this, and that means it's gonna evolve. So any player suffers two damage, and so you'd have to suffer two damage. Though. Oh, I forgot about that part. Yeah. Um, <laughs> I changed my mind, Joe. If you were really offering, that'd be lovely. Okay, take two damage. Yeah. And did your card cost zero? Yes. Hmm. That's a, yeah, that's a thing. That's a thing. Hmm. I really want that thing, because I'm going to start... <laughs> I mean, I could... Like, make y'all draw cards. It's a moment I get that, yeah. What is it? Plus six, that thing uses pulse tokens to... as ether. See, I could buy it right now, but I want charges. Doesn't do me any good, because I'm not getting pulse tokens. Yeah, Orlando or Rose? Why don't you go ahead and go, because you have a spark. You can take care of one of those. I Wait, do... I have a spark, too. But... <laughs> I can do three damage or something. Three damage? Because he's gonna open it. He's gonna. Ah, uh, okay. So I'll do those two and open. The you gotta do the spark first, huh? Oh, you're. I can do. I'll oh do yeah, spark. yeah. Spark first. So. I guess you want to do it to this. Yeah. Down to four. And then I'll do two more. Open the breach. Nice. And then I will. Melissa Spark will take that guy out. Mm -hmm. Or my two Sparks will take that guy out. We still have 60 hit points up there, too. I think he's going to do more, right? No. Oh, he can't okay. do any more damage. Oh, okay. So now I need, should I buy another one of those things I bought earlier to pick up pulses, or should I or should I um, start charging up the thing to... I think I need charges. This is yeah. getting low. All right, I'll do two charges. All right. And I'm done. Cool. Oh, my turn. Mm -hmm. I spark at that guy. Down he did. with the wires. Wires and down. I prep this spark. And I have six. One, two, three, four, five, six ether. So I'm going to charge it up. Joe, do you have a purple one, thing two, yet? Three, four, five, six. No, it's coming up. Okay. I'm dead. It's one of these two. Oh, um, you can go. Go for it. All right, what do y'all want out of these sparks? Hit the Leviathan or hit the dude? Hmm. The dude is not hurting us every turn. I say the Leviathan. Get him down to five. Yeah, here. It's great. Hold. Let's 
two damage to this guy. All right, and then I'm gonna prep, sparking siphon, prep, sparking siphon, three crystals to open this. Nice. Prep, minion's bane. And this card is just gonna be in my hand because I can't do anything with it mm -hmm. at this point. So those go in there. One, two, three. Cards are flying. Gears. Oh, yeah. <laughs> They're going everywhere. Four. All right. It's you. It's oh, you. you already flipped it. Mm hmm. I took a break from playing in my cards. I'll never flip it over <laughs> so you guys could go ahead. I was distracted by it. Brain knife, somebody can flip a thing. I mean, uh, twist, focus, whatever. Uh -huh. Um, Unless you delete, really, you can prep four spells up there right now. Yeah. Okay. This would only just be for the. The plus quicker I get that open, I can prep four spells as well, and that's a plus one in there. So. Game three. Right now my sparks are already so plus one, so that's good. Actually, um, Joe, you go ahead and gain three plus tokens, and you can lose one of those if you want to. Destroy a card in your hand. But you don't have to. You can keep them for uh, ether next time. I'll do that because I need to get rid of some of these. Alright, so I have five here. I could keep doing what I was doing. Or I can join the damage train, which is kind of cool. And get this. The breach community because might be this neat actually does something with you the. You can't get that one though. Spell. Yeah, it's you're right. But I, let me read this before I do it. Uh, when played this turn, you go on top of the deck or one of the discard pile. Wow. Um, Your deck is so small. It's like. I don't know. That breach communion might be good for you though, because you constantly have those things. Yeah, you're right. You can't get that either. Right. It's a four. It's four. I can afford four. One, two, three, four. Oh, okay. Uh, so yeah, I'm getting that. And the other one will just go wherever. Oh, I had a spark. I probably should have cast. Um, we'll assume you yeah, did. That's fine. Just needs to go into the pile before all the rest of it does. Yeah, yeah. Let's see how many cards. Three. I'm gonna draw that. So I need to think about this. Let's put this here. The spark's gonna go underneath the breach communion. Fair. That's what I'm drawing. Well, darn. <laughs> Alright. Nemesis. Nope. 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 Nothing, nothing. Nothing, nothing. <gasps> the player with the most expensive card in hand degrades that card. I have all zeros. Oh, I have a four. Okay. I, a four. I have two fours. And so really whoever does it also has to suffer three damage. I'll do it. Uh, degrading this, when I destroy a card, gain a charge. And then I'll take this thing. In my hand? And three damage. Um. And three damage. Place it in their hand. Alright. Oops. Up there. Over here. Alright. Done. All right, and then we have the Leviathan. Two damage to Gravehold, please. I put it at 17. Slides, right? Yep, thank you. Get rid of that garbage. Waylay. Unleash twice. Nothing. Waylay. Any player suffers one damage. Um, Melissa's at 10. Oh. Two. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> Gravehold suffers one damage for each player turn order card in the turn order discard pile. One, two, three, four. The maximum it could. One, Luck is on our side today, folks. Four. Gravehold needs help. <laughs> Badly. Doing all right. Um, Not according to the people of okay. <laughs> That's what you think. Um, Look, did you? One, two, three, four more damage to Gravehold, please. 
One, two, three. <laughs> we're Joe, at nine. Come on. I thought you were healing. Two damage to Gravehold, please. Nine, eight. We're at seven. Nothing, nothing. Could you shuffle these? Okay, so we can choose. Unleash twice, any player loses two charges. Or unleash twice, evolve. I guess unleash twice, evolve. Mm hmm. Any player discards a card in hand. Um, I could do that. Done. Could you read E22? E22, please. E22. Um... The Nameless has been searching for additional power. Finally, it has found the strength it needs in a nearby breach. Satisfied, it hunts you with renewed vigor. Banish Sap. Mm -hmm. Place E23 in the discard pile. Yeah, that's worse. Let's hope we don't ever have to face it. Mm. Mm. You had one job. <laughs> one, two, three, four, five, six damage to Gravehold. Seven, eight. We lose. Oh, that was fast. Oh, dear. I felt like we were doing so well. Well, we lost. So, let's see what this says. What does that mean? <laughs> Thanks for playing. Thanks if you playing. lost your first game versus Maelstrom Risen, fight it again. Be sure to follow the losing the game rules on page 20. If you won, blah, blah, blah. If you lose two games, read blah, blah, blah. <laughs> we don't need to go through all of that. So let's look at page 20 since we've never actually had to do this before. Wow. Well, now we're having we remembered fun. our spells from every time. Oh, it you know, it's part bad. of forgetting everything. Bad news. If only we remembered everything, it was good from right from the start. What do you mean forgetting everything? They said that very early in the story. It's like part of being a breach mage is to forget everything you knew every time you go into battle. That explains us having to put everything back. Oh, I don't even remember that. Yeah. Well, the last game I reminded it. We lost memories there, too, didn't we? Oh, yeah, that's true. Yeah, it's okay. all about the memories so we, thing. Yeah, we got if the players memory. lose the first time they play a chapter, they retreat from the Nemesis and must fight that Nemesis one more time with the following stipulations. They may switch out one card in the supply for a card that they either banished from the supply or did not choose to add to the supply in previous games. For the next game, Malastar will provide some assistance. You gain the Malastar's gift token. During the game, any player may spend the token during their main phase to have any player and grave hold gain five life each. This token can only be used once in that game. Hmm. During the next game, you do not place any evolve stickers or transform any cards. You may choose to evolve a card, but nothing will happen. Oh. We need to remember that next time. Well, we're almost at stickers anyways. <laughs> yeah, we, we literally have only have left. two more stickers <laughs> left. And we've evolved pretty much everything in the game. Mm -hmm. But this one won't get any stickers when it comes out. True. Oh, I was wondering what it turned into. <laughs> <laughs> All this time. It's Something like bigger we'll never than a find Leviathan. out. Yeah. So. What's bigger than a Leviathan. That is the end of our game tonight. Oh, Lord. Yeah, well. Not, chalk another kind of loss. A downer. <laughs> I mean, I'm glad it was now and not like. Look how much of this deck is still left. I mean, yeah. we we didn't we yeah, just barely made it into level two. Just just for just for giggles' sake, the next card wasn't much better. Oh wow! Yeah, the next card was all not bad much better. all the time. Mm -hmm. So, um, yeah. if you are watching this 
over on YouTube, do us a favor, head over to twitch.tv slash heartboardgames and give us a follow there. You can interact live with us while we're playing. That's right. We really heart that. Yes. <laughs> so, oh, what, what do we have coming up? Let's see. A little, a little bit more uh, friendly interaction with the chat on Wednesday. Hmm? A, little, a little more lighthearted. Yeah. Games on Wednesday? Yes, we'll be playing two games yeah. on Wednesday. It's the W Day, Ooh. Wednesday, for Welcome To and Wordsy. Ah. So Welcome mm. To, you, okay. you can actually play along with us that one. Um, if you have a tablet at your house, you can download the Welcome To app and play along with us. So we hope you'll join us on Wednesday for that. You can also probably play along with Wordsy, too, at home. Mm -hmm. Oh, absolutely, yeah. yeah so see words. if you can create better words than we do. I'm sure you will. Yeah. <laughs> Um, this coming Sunday, we have a special for Father's Day, Terra Mystica, Dad's favorite game. Oh, yes. Um, I haven't played that in like five years, so I have to get out the instruction manual. I want to be the mermaids, play. I hope. Let's I see. hope, I hope, I hope it's <laughs> That's me. the only class I still remember. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and then, of course, on Monday, we'll be back with Aeons and Legacy again. Uh, again. Because we'll need to take this challenge on again and maybe next time we'll do Revenge better. Revenge of the Breach Mages. We need to look back through all of our cards and see if we see any that give Gravehold life because maybe that's something okay, we should right. focus on now that we know what to expect. Yep. You know, we can get a card that actually helps Gravehold gain life. Uh, life. I'm sure there's one because we have a stack of cards like this thick that we back bypassed over and have, have discarded so mm -hmm. like there's got to be one in there that gives Gravehold some life. Yep. So thank you guys so much for being here tonight. We uh, love when you're here interacting with us in chat. Um, I think it's a little quieter because this is a legacy game yep. and people don't want to get spoiled. Um, people want to wait and watch it later on YouTube after they finish their run through it. So that's cool. But um, we love to spread the board game love around here, which means we like spread to... Spread the board game love. Which means we like to raid over to other content creators here on Twitch. Uh, tonight it is the board room gamer. Yeah, I don't think we've ever been there before. He's soloing Tiny Towns. Ooh, oh, nice I like towns. Tiny Towns. We should play that on this channel if we can borrow it from a friend. Uh, so yeah. thank you guys for being here again yes. tonight. <laughs> Such a downer end. But uh, anyways, till right. next time, the box is, is closed. closed. We'll see you next time, everybody. Bye-bye.